Hi Sarah, Phil B here from the Wilderness Club. Just a quick recap on our lesson this morning. So lots of things have got better for me. The lines have got much better. The head tilt, you know, the head not dropping as much has got better. But focus a bit more on your eye line for me. So when you look as here, as you're turning, that head's just moving too much, isn't it? So not so much it's dropped too much, but the head, the you know, the eyes are literally looking over here somewhere now. If we look at Michelle Wee's head here as she swings back, you know, look at that Nike tick. That Nike tick is at an angle, i.e., oh, that's terrible, like that. It doesn't move, you know, once she gets to the top there. Look how stable that head is, okay? Now, with your eye line looking down there, where are you going to want to strike the ball? You know, behind it, from looking at that angle. So this is one of the reasons why... You know, as you're coming down now, Sarah, the weight is taking a long time to move to the left. Because for me, you're still, you know, when your head's now just starting to look there. And it takes too long to get back to the ball. So I feel if the head doesn't move as much, I, I don't mind it, like I said, dropping. It's not dropping anywhere near, but we've got to keep the eyes focused on the ball. Okay. And then from there, it'll be easier for you to get back to the ball. It's, it, all it is, is, Sarah, is you've worked so hard on your backswing. Um, you know, keep stopping that head. That we just need to for almost forget that little bit now. Let it go and just start working on head still, and then driving. You know, I want to see that weight moving onto that left side quicker. You know, that stage there. If we look at Michelle Wee at the same stage, I mean, look how much more athletic she looks. Definitely, nearly all of her weight is on her left side. That left leg of hers is straightening. Yours, your legs still look like they're in flexion, like they were at setup. You know, when we come through to hit yours, if we focus on your left foot, we can see it's lifting off the ground. So that tells us, I mean, at this stage here, there's no pressure in that right, left side at all. All the weight is still stuck on that right side, and it's going to be impossible for you to take a divot. If the weight's on the right, we're only going to try and sort of pick the ball off the top. So that's what we're working hard on, is trying to shift forwards earlier. Look at your left leg now, it's leaning backwards slightly. Look at Michelle's at that same stage as yours. If we drive through to the same position as her, we can see her left leg, I'd say, is dead straight, okay? Where yours is just leaning back a bit, Sarah. And again, for me, there's too much weight. If we go through to your follow-through, look at this foot here. Because it hasn't turned all of the way, there's still going to be quite a lot of weight still on that right side. Again, we look at Michelle Wees. She goes right onto her toe. So loads of good stuff, loads of good stuff. You mustn't beat yourself up. I just want to see... Head stay stiller or eyes more on the ball. That'll make a massive difference. You know, wherever your eyes look is where you're going to make contact. So if we're looking behind, we're struggling. Let's get them, that, that eyes on the ball and let's start working, you know, pushing that pelvis forwards, really exploding on that left side. Let's keep that left foot on the ground and hit me some massive divots. And uh, you're going to see some fantastic results there. You must stick with it uh, because honestly, it's going to be game changer. Thank you.